This math knowledge practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat says, if x equals y, then negative 5 minus 4 times x minus y equals, again, on the ASVAB and PyCat, you're not given a reference sheet or a calculator. So as you work out these practice test questions, you want to get in the habit of copying things down and working them out on your own scratch paper. In this case, we're told x equals y, but we're not told what either of those values are. So I'm going to pick any value that I want. So I'm going to say x is 2 because 2 is pretty easy to work with. That means y is also going to be 2. So now we know x is 2 and y is 2, and we can plug it into this expression and evaluate it accordingly. This becomes negative 5 minus 4 times x is 2, y is 2, 2 minus 2. Now, in order to get this one right, you really have to pay close attention to the order of operations. Again, you evaluate expressions according to the order of operations, which I remember using the acronym PEMDAS or the mnemonic device. Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. This tells you to work out what's in parentheses first, followed by exponents if there are any. Then you do multiplication and division in the expression as they appear from left to right. That is to say they have equal precedence. And then you do addition and subtraction as they appear in the expression from left to right. That is to say, they're treated as equals as well. So what do we have here? We have subtraction here, negative 5 minus 4. We have 4 times uh, something in parentheses. So we have multiplication here. And then inside parentheses, we have 2 minus 2. So again, according to the order of operations, we're going to do what's in parentheses first. This becomes negative 5 minus 4. 2 minus 2 is 0. Again, we only have two operations left. We have subtraction, uh, negative 5 minus 4, and multiplication, negative 4 times 0. Again, anything times 0 is 0, so negative 4 times 0 is 0. That just leaves you with negative 5. So the answer to this one is B, negative 5.